In occasion of EASA 2014 annual conference, which took place in Rome on 15th and 16th of October, we recorded for our YouTube and Act channel a short declaration from Mr. Patrick Key, EASA Director General. So we are extremely happy to be uh, here today in Rome uh, for this uh, first uh, EASA conference on general aviation. We have uh, a record audience of 350 people, which is by far the largest audience that we've ever had in, uh, uh, in EASA conferences. And uh, uh, I'm sure it's uh, due to the fact that we are in Rome, but also due to the fact that uh, uh, general aviation is a key topic of interest to the community. What are the key messages that uh, we are exchanging here? First, um, general aviation is an important sector of the aviation economy and of the national economies. And we just need to make sure that we do not overburden this sector with uh, overregulation or with rules which will strangle uh, the actors of general aviation. The second topic is that um, we need to be proportionate in everything that we do, not necessarily to regulate, um, because at the end of the day, we are not certain that uh, regulations create in this particular field necessarily an increase in the level of safety, but we need to find also other ways such as um, education, training, information about the risks that are taken in the sector in order to reach a higher level of safety. One of the things that we discussed um, has to deal with the fact that uh, most of the accidents which are taking place uh, in general aviation are due to uh, pilot uh, mistakes, um, uh, uh, pilot's behavior in general, or pilot's training. And this is definitely a key area for investment for us, an area that we are willing to work with uh, in order to increase the level of safety, but it's also certainly the most difficult area because um, when we talk about the mindset, when we talk about the culture, risk assessment culture in the pilot community for G general aviation, this is, these are topics which are very difficult to deal with and uh, we need to take the proper steps in order to uh, be able to increase the level of safety. We had discussions on what else we could do, uh, such as um, uh, in increasing uh, the level of technological enhancements on board the aircraft. There, there are uh, immediate solutions uh, which can increase the level of safety on board the aircraft. We are looking at it at the moment. We are also working with our American colleagues on how to simplify the way in which we certify general aviation products in order to have a smaller time to market, uh, which I think is an essential element to have affordable solutions, technological solutions. We are also looking at uh, other fields such as um, uh, enhancing uh, the possibility for pilots to get uh, ratings or licenses for flying under instrument conditions. This is an area of improvement for Europe when we think about the US situation where 50% of the pilots are uh, rated for instrument uh, flying. Uh, in Europe we are at less than 10% I think. So this is definitely an area for improvement in Europe. So I think it's so far a very successful um, event here and I'm pretty sure that there will be very concrete uh, solutions which will come out, out of uh, this event and that we will have a new energy going in the general aviation sector because of this Rome event. So uh, I thank a lot the organizers, INAC and the Italian Presidency of the Union for having organized this event here with us in Rome. Thank you.